Hi there, I'm Anton from Anton's Mindstorms Hacks. In this video, I want to talk about an upgrade to the Mechanum wheel car here. And I, um, it's about this little PCB here. It's a board that I built and designed together with a friend. And um, I'm, I'm having it produced uh, now and it's for sale on my website. And the cool thing about this board is, is that it allows any LEGO Mindstorms robot to communicate with a gamepad. Could be a PlayStation 4 controller like I have laying around, could be a Switch controller, but basically any modern universal Bluetooth uh, controller uh, will work here. Um, how this works is that this uh, chip here runs a special firmware that powers on the Bluetooth that's also on this chip and it searches for gamepads. So as soon as it sees a gamepad um, that uh, it's compatible with, it tries to pair and read the state. Um, connecting it to the spike is just as simple as um, um, connecting it here with uh, the wire. So let's put in the wire there in this port and then the um, the mindstorms or spike hub can just automatically powers on the board and can communicate um, I've uh, created with the same friend a handy communication library that's universal but it's also very handy to communicate with the gamepad it's called serial talk and uh, but I've don't worry about the library I created some examples so you can easily get started with the uh, gamepads um, let's reconnect here. Let's reconnect the board. Of course, you want a demonstration, so let's give a demonstration here. Now, the board is connected and powered on. The next thing we're going to do is power on the PlayStation controller. I'm going to power it on by pressing the share and the PlayStation button simultaneously. And um, then the um, light here on top starts flashing. It went really quick this time. You can see it connected immediately because the light here turns blue. Now I'm starting the program here. So it's a regular Spike Prime program. And um, as soon as the program starts, you can see that the sticks become active here. The, con the um, connection is pretty lagless. So you can see um, a very small movement results in a um, quick reaction here from the Mechanum wheel car. So this has got way less lag than the default LEGO solution. It's a direct gamepad to robot connection. There is no computer in between, well, except for this very small ESP32 computer in there. And it, you, you have this very fast and flexible um, solution. Of course, you can do all movements in all directions, just like in my previous movie. For this robot, the building instructions are on my Patreon website. I put a link in the description. You can buy the board on my website. It's for sale there. I've got three versions. Uh, the basic version is good enough for PlayStation remote control. I also have an advanced version with a voltage converter and a microphone, um, which is handy if um, you want to add servos to your uh, uh, robot inventor hub so for instance with servos on board you can build walking spiders like this and you can expand the possibility of your robot inventor kit even further okay that's it for the um, mechanum wheel playstation remote control robot uh, also uh, be sure to watch my other video about this mechanum car where, where i explain how it works and how it changes uh, direction i'll put a link in the top right corner and uh, thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe and hope to see you here again. Bye bye.